front of Landsberger Allee S-Bahn and I'm going to show you a typical German Berliner neighborhood which is Landsberger Allee so yeah stick around so yeah this is Landsberger Allee it's a very modern area at least near the train station near the S-Bahn which is this thing over here and this whole thing underneath these pillars it's an aqua center it's basically uh, a couple of swimming pools a couple of uh, trampolines for diving uh, all related to water sports you have here underneath this platform which this platform is a park so the park is situated on top of the aqua center so let's view the park basically of course, just near the park over there, in the distance, there's a Christmas market where they sell Christmas trees. Well, eh? Let's see if we can get a closer look. And also enter the park at the same time. It's a place where they sell Christmas trees. But anyway, more important is the park, the structure. So all this place is surrounded by modern buildings, all this park thing. There we go. So all those buildings in the distance over there are brand new and these are hotels all of them and those in the distance over there they're business centers but yeah so this is a park uh, how, how big can be is around 300 meters by 300 meters and this is the aqua center this is the top part of the aqua center because most of it is underground yeah most of it is underground and yeah this is the christmas tree thingy there are some prices over there on those yellow labels but it's just too far to zoom in but anyway how it is so on the many so yeah these are the new developments which are apartments generally and also office buildings and different facilities they're really revamping up this neighborhood really really doing that let's have a closer look at what is being built <clears throat> sorry yeah so there's a lot of uh, let's say neighborhood utilities like sports grounds children's play ground yes <laughs> children's playgrounds and sports grounds over here so even this was not around a couple of months ago as you can see very very interesting this is gonna be much more expensive in the future because now the prices are still decent in this area Las Vegas Allee so yeah see everything is still under construction where well, it's gonna be nice when it's gonna be finished I would say well of course Las Vegas Allee has not only these let's say parts full of uh, utilities for the general public and full of nice modern buildings so let's get to the nitty gritty part this is actually one of the biggest donor kebabs, room donor kebabs in Berlin 
So yeah, I mean the more real part of Landsberg Allee, the more common, common, communist, ex-communist neighborhood basically, which is fine, has nothing wrong with that. But this is like uh, how the majority of people live in this neighborhood, in the old comic blocks. As you can see, like this part of the neighborhood has also some good utilities, like kindergartens, and there's a Kaufland not far from here. The Kaufland. It's one of the biggest Kauflands in this part of Berlin. I used to live here in this area for a little bit and I used to shop in this Kaufland. Oh yeah, you'll see it. So this is like a typical landscape, housing landscape of Berlin. Of Landsberg Allee, I mean. <laughs> This is it, and those in front, like four story high, most of them, three story, three story high, some of them. And that's a kindergarten or a school. This is it. As you can see, there's a cow plant just in front of us, and this is where the majority of people actually do their shopping in this part of Landsberg Allee, in the neighborhood, in the back streets. The parking lot of the cow plant. So it looks around it. is it the entrance of the store basically so yeah so yeah subscribe to this channel if you want to hear what I'm saying about reality in Germany and not only and click the notification bell if you want to get notified whenever I'm posting and in the description there will be a donation link which I invite you to use but I can't force you of course and yeah, so far so good. So what?